What's going on everybody? Sound Control back with the Hydrosynth. Today we're just gonna create a random patch. I'm at init already. I got, you know, everything set up so it's sending a saw wave. Um, I'm gonna give myself about 10-15 minutes to come up with something interesting while talking to you guys as I'm going through this process. So I'm going to start off by just setting everything to wave scan because I'm not going to waste any time. And usually, y'all should know my process by now. Once I get into wave scan window, I'm just randomizing a bunch of things arbitrarily. I'm not even listening to what it's doing. Um, I'm just going in because I always want to discover something new. Ooh, I'm not even doing it right. <laughs> I was hitting shift instead of uh, randomize. But as you can see, I just randomized both uh, of the oscillators wave scan don't ask me like why I just I just like to start off with that then I assign an LFO to wave scan I'm not even listening to I'm not really listening to it um we'll start listening to it later but yeah like I said I assigned LFO 1 to oscillator 1's wave scan then what I'm going to do is I uh do the same with oscillator 2 and LFO 2 to wave scan that's just like my normal course of action then um, I'm then taking that and usually I'm, um, you know, adding an envelope to the rate at which the, the LFO is going. So um, envelope five, I'll send it to rate one. Envelope four, I'll say it, set it to rate two. And then um, in those envelopes, I actually go in and just do a bunch of just random, randomized shaping. I'm not really like going for precision I'm just more so going for um, oh I'm also assigning a trigger source to LFO 3 because that hasn't been um, touched I, I guess um, but yeah that was uh, this is envelope it's one of the envelopes this is another one of the envelopes it's gonna mess with the curve a little bit the curvature of the you know uh, I'm honestly hmm and I'm thinking about it. I'm gonna throw in some holds. Gonna throw in some of that. Now you can't really hear what's going on there. Obviously, it just sounds like a bunch of noise um, because you have oscillator four going to oscillator, I think LFO one or two, whatever. Um, but essentially, I'm gonna slow down these rates and let's see. As you can see, it's actually working. <laughs> It's like uh, one of those uh, envelopes actually. Okay, so this has. I'm going to set this to uh, to be triggered by oscillator, uh, low frequency oscillator four. No, two. Um, yeah, don't don't ask me why. I just. Uh, so essentially what I did was I sent LFO to wave scan. LFO is going to operate in cycles. So to, you know, increase sort of create some sort of variability and unpredictableness you add an envelope to the rate of LFO also mess around with the LFO um, shapes so I'm just gonna arbitrarily go to a random shape and let's see let's go random step in mm. I might I might actually do some random things because normally I wouldn't I do random so we're going to latch this. So this is latched. So this is what I get when I do all those settings. Actually, I'm going to pitch everything down. I saw this on a video before. Now, I think the issue with this is I'm going to add some sustain at a specific level. I'm going to add some mutant one. That's cool. So this is PW original. So I think as I have ratio go up, I'm gonna have feedback go down. It's 
So we're gonna have one LFO control feedback. And then we're gonna have another LFO control ratio. And then remember these these LFOs are actually being triggered by this too. Let's do just a random let's just Let's go back to LFO one. I'm looking for the the craziest type of sounds. Let me see. So far we're at five minutes. Not bad. Uh, but we need to make some progress. So, so that, 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 I mean, really, that's that's pretty self-explanatory. Get further. Oh yeah, this is only oscillator one for God, totally. Gonna add some reverb just to make it sound a little bit more pleasant. I know it sounds crazy right now. I'm gonna add some. Gonna definitely add some. Uh, Feedback as well as depth. Assigning a match macro now. Why I don't know why, but sheesh. All right, so now. Macro four. I mean, mutant four. We don't think about this. Like that. Yo, we're gonna throw rate three. Rate three isn't moving much. I can like tell. Yo, that's hard. Alright, that's crazy. Alright, so let's bring in oscillator three. Just the basic.
I think we're gonna set this to LFO4 cut off. Let's have let's have three control four. Adding some chorus. Yeah, some chorus right here. Actually, Flanger is my favorite, actually. LFO one, see how active LFO one is? We're gonna send that to Flanger. <laughs> Cause also we're gonna have filter two. Add some some distort. Actually, we're gonna we're gonna go back on that. We're gonna add some lo-fi. We're gonna we're gonna take LFO two and send it to. Now we're just gonna like cross wire lots of this uh, LFO situation going here just so it just causes more chaos, you know what I'm saying? And let's just, uh, yeah, it's all cross wired now. So at this point, if I unlatch it, and I press a note, should go pretty good. Here's the thing. We need more envelopes controlling these LFOs. So we're literally just gonna uh, do exactly that. We're gonna have uh, envelope run, impact LFO 4. We're also gonna have we're gonna have the LFO's impact panning. Dang, we have 15 minutes. So what we're going to do now, I mean, we're at 15 minutes, but what we're going to do 
we're going to do one last thing. We're just going to go crazy and assign each of these LFOs to an envelope attack and see what happens. Because remember, we have the rate being controlled by... Um, I'm going to just show y'all. Dang, I got a text. Let me just do this. Uh, let me just do this. All right, let's see what happens. This is a nice... Do you hear this? This is a great... If I, if I hit Yo, this is fire Now let me shoot some. You know what, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna start messing around with frequency Cause like, I don't be putting Nah, you can't This is it. Oh, hold on, let me see. Yeah, I'm... So we made some noise today. Um, glad you could watch this glitchage. <laughs> I mean, but I live for this, like you know. I'm pulling the clouds.
well, I mean, that was 12, 20 minutes. Yeah, um, I'm probably, I don't know, I might keep this, I might keep a recording of this and sound design some drums from this soundscape, but yeah, it was dope exploring with y'all. I could probably make some nice hi-hats, maybe some kicks, I don't know. Maybe I'll make a next the next beat from this soundscape. But um, with that being said, thank you for watching. Peace.